Merced police released surveillance video showing a family of four being kidnapped at gunpoint on Monday. They have a suspect in custody, but the family is still missing. Ann Makovic joins us now with the latest on this search. Yeah, Ryan, it's been two days since the family was kidnapped, and the suspect actually attempted suicide, so he's not talking. Police are hoping the new video can provide some clues. This is video from the family's business Monday morning. You can see there in the back the uh, mask kidnapper following one of the family members into the building, pulling out a gun, and then later two men are brought back out the back door with their hands tied behind their backs and forced into a vehicle. And there you see the suspect went back inside and brought out a woman and her baby girl, just eight months old. Among those victims, little Ahuri Derry, her mother, Jasleen Kaur, father, Jazdeep Singh, and uncle, Amandeep Singh. Police were alerted that they were missing after a pickup truck registered to the family was found on fire near Winton. Their family members say that they are peaceful, hardworking people, and they're just praying somebody might step forward to help. So I want to say strongly again to everybody who are watching me, please help us out, come forward. So my family come home safe. We are devastated. We are shocked. We are dying every moment not finding any clues. And police aren't releasing any information about any relationship the victims might have had with the suspect, and they arrested 40-year-old 48-year-old, rather, Jesus Manuel Salgado on Tuesday as he tried to use a credit card belonging to one of the victims. But right now, he is in critical condition. Police say he tried to take his own life right before he was captured. Salgado previously spent 10 years in prison for armed residential robbery and witness intimidation. He was then released on parole in 2015.